electrodes are actually placed on your brain and with a neurofeedback therapist, you are actually training your brain waves to be more focused and calm. As a parent who has a child with ADD or ADHD, you may be wondering, are there other effective treatment options available? And the answer is yes. First, you're right to be concerned because there are rising rates of kids abusing these drugs either on or off label. There are more kids than ever selling these drugs to their friends, taking it recreationally, and especially in children and teens, these have long lasting and very detrimental effects. The first effective treatment alternative is cognitive behavioral therapy. Behavioral therapy helps kids and sometimes parents and kids together to set up strategies that are going to help to manage symptoms. The second effective strategy that has been shown to treat this disorder is what we call neurofeedback or EEG biofeedback. This is a non-invasive procedure where electrodes are actually placed on your brain and with a neurofeedback therapist, you are actually training your brain waves to be more focused and calm. The third effective treatment alternative is make sure you talk to your doctor or your nutritionist about getting proper nutrition because things like omega-3 oils, which are so good for the brain, have been shown to be really good for kids. And if your kid or you are not getting the, the omega-3s that your brain needs to really thrive, that can sometimes manifest itself in ADD, ADHD-like symptoms. The fourth and final treatment option that is very effective is mindful meditation. In studies with teens at UCLA, this has been shown to be almost as effective as Adderall in treating this disorder. So look for a mindful meditation practitioner on, the, on websites uh, such as John Kabat-Zinn's website at the University of Massachusetts. You can find a practitioner to teach your child. This releases dopamine in the brain and again is an effective and non-addictive treatment alternative.